Hey, welcome back. Uh, in this uh, video, uh, what we are basically going to do is to give uh, a little more uh, functionality to the tags and the categories uh, pages. So uh, let's see how it looks now. In here, when you go into your slash categories, you can basically see the list of, uh, of the existing categories and uh, the same for tags. And if you go and press uh, one category, it uh, displays this and uh, with uh, no real uh, functionality. So let's uh, make uh, a little uh, table in here that uh, we can link the existing uh, uh, posts uh, that has these categories and uh, the users can uh, refer to them uh, as of now. So basically, what uh, we want to do is, uh, is this. We can go into our project, into our, let's say, first for our categories and the show.blade.php. And uh, beneath uh, this row, we need to do uh, another row. So let's do this, dot row. And we need to have uh, uh, li something like this, call md6. And uh, inside of here, let's do this. Let's go down here a bit. Like so, in here, let's say, category, like so. And let's uh, open up uh, a bold uh, tag. And in double curly braces, we'll say dollar category cut gory uh, and the name uh, in here let's say is in and let's give it a little strong uh, is in uh, let's say the style it's all inline styling for now the color of red in here uh, let's go and in inside of our strong uh, tag let's say dollar category dollar category and posts posts function and uh, let's count it so this this should be okay let me just uh, check uh, something real quick dollar post it's in our tags okay so let's have a look let's have a look in our post users basically aha uh -huh. Okay, in here, as you can see, it uh, it goes uh, into our tag model. But if we if uh, we will go into our categories model, we can see that we named it the posts cat. So let's uh, copy this in here and let's paste this here. Post cat and right now it goes into our categories and uh, we'll count it. Uh, so after this, uh, let's say, um, what shall we say, after the B, let's give after the B a little small, small tag, in here is in, and after the, the strong, let's close the small and let's say posts like so so let's see what this gives us yes a nice little uh, category past oh so let's in here category like so the name of it will be like so 
okay that's about fine let's save this some spacing and the category pasta is in one post okay that works fine and beneath this beneath the, the column d6 uh, inside the more more correctly uh, inside of here beneath the h1 uh, tag what we basically need to do is a table table and uh, let's give it a class of table class of table in here what uh, we need to do is uh, let's say uh, th t head let's create that and uh, inside of here let's give it a table row inside the table row let's uh, say uh, what wait a minute wait a minute uh, oh it's th yes in the th let's say post name and this looks okay let's say another th just for fun uh, links okay and uh, let's close the hr it's close let's close the uh, the t h and the t body t body will be a, a for each loop at for each for categories category sorry category and uh, the title for each t body will be for the category uh, posts cut which is this post cut as a dollar uh, post and after the dollar post after inside of this will basically give a table row table row of uh, the inside of here let's say a table a, uh, table age and the inside of here in here dollar post will give us uh, the title and after this another one and uh, what we basically need to do is an anchor tag the href would be a route to the the slug and the, the slug name so what we need to do is uh, like this let's say the route would be b like here b dot s b dot s with dollar post slug with the slug of the id and the class would be let's say a class of btn btn uh, let's say info uh, btn btn info inside of here let's say go to post go to post let's give it a btn uh, large btn large and uh, this should work correctly after this we need to end the for each at end for each let's save this and uh, see what uh, that gives us right here okay route b dot s not defined oh maybe i think not this one we called it uh, something else let's open another one send it into blog and php artisan route list yes in here
let's see yes it's a uh, slug just slug route slug okay and should be fine okay as you can see it gives us a nice little uh, interface in here that uh, the users can uh, go and uh, directly into into that uh, post post name making a post with categories and the links go to post and in here we have our post which is our slug the main uh, the front end the uh, interface for for our users and by the way as you can see right here the button let's uh, let's uh, correct this right now in here let's go inside our b.s and all the posts should be inside a row like so that row and so x after this div this should fix us quite well okay yes it's inside of here everything is looking great let's uh, go ahead and uh, do this for the do this for the tags too so in our uh, where is it where is it tags and show after this let's go ahead let's in our categories let's copy the row that we just made like so where where does it end in here let's copy this and uh, in our tags dot show after the row let's copy this save this for now okay in here let's uh, change uh, the the necessary thing sorry that's tag and dollar dollar tag and the name okay and the color is in not in category but in tag and posts this is in our tag yes we will count it we will display it post name and tag let's change this into this and this into tag copy this wait a minute wait a minute tag from post as tag okay this looks fine route slug dollar post and the slug go to post okay that looks open that looks uh, fine let's go inside uh, let's see all the post and uh, let's go directly into our tags in the next video we are going to work on our oh what is tags not tag tags tags and we have only one tag yes we have only one tag let's uh, see if we have only one tag I think we have more travel is in four posts okay think we have a little problem let's go into our posts dot create and the tags okay we have only one tag and yes no we don't have I just thought we have more uh, <laughs> more uh, tags never mind so uh, basically as you can see it, it works uh, very nicely oh in here variable post undefined variable in our tags.show we didn't change something tags is posts oh in here dollar tag where is it where is it where is it 
what line? Line 27 route dollar tag. Let's have a look. And uh, yes, it uh, works correctly. I just uh, didn't change uh, the necessary things. Go to post. So wait a minute, wait a minute. It, this won't work for us. B and tags. Go to post. No, it uh, works very, very nicely. And uh, as you can see, it's a pretty nice uh, interface and pretty useful. So in the next video, we're going to add uh, a functionality into our navbar. And uh, some uh, after this, we will add uh, an admin and the uh, users and uh, work uh, with the middlewares. So uh, we have uh, a lot of things to do and we are uh, advanced in advancing in our blog uh, very nicely. So I'll see you next time. Don't forget to subscribe.